Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever, whenever it resonates. I did one yesterday, and I, I said the wrong date, and you would not believe the people that don't get it. Oh, <laughs> you would, because I tell you guys all the time, you said the wrong date, or they, they, they corrected me. There are no clocks in the universe. The date is irrelevant. Page of Cups reversed. This is lack of emotion. Somebody could have their heart set on somebody that is literally emotionally unavailable. Oh my goodness, the devil reversed. Now, this is taking back control of a situation. This is freedom. Nine of Swords. We have somebody here that is very worried and anxious. This could be a child as well. We could have a child that is um, crying. We have somebody here that is very, very worried. I'll tell you that right now. This person is worried, very, very worried, could be worried about their child. Um, now this is taking back control of a situation. This is worried, anxious, depressed, thinking about it a lot. Somebody is thinking about something a lot. They could be thinking about an unrequited love situation as well. If it's not a child, this is like a loveless situation, okay? Somebody may have been involved in a loveless situation with somebody that was incapable of loving. They were only in it for all the wrong reasons by the looks of things. But anyway, uh, let's see what else we get here. King of Swords. Yeah, this is, this is somebody who isn't in it for love. Okay, not saying that this person can't love, but this is somebody that is intellectually minded, not interested in practicality. This is somebody that is just very um, to the point. Matter of fact, now somebody is thinking this could be. I was going to say this could be a lawyer. This could be a lawyer. Somebody may be thinking about getting a lawyer, thinking about involving the law. This is somebody that is um, an investigator. Somebody is thinking about something, definitely. Thinking about taking control. Five of Wands reversed. There is some sort of uh, reluctance, though. There is reluctance here. Hangman. Hangman reversed. Will it be successful? Will it be somebody is thinking about? There's a lack of confidence here. There is definitely a lack of confidence. Hangman reversed. This is um, somebody has been wasting their time. Uh, sacrificing themselves. So stalling. Somebody is stalling. Because of their own lack of confidence. Somebody may be wanting to get a divorce to break free from something. It could be a divorce or to regain control of a situation. Whatever this is. It's like somebody is really, 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 really contemplating. And really, really thinking about getting a lawyer. Or something like that. Or involving the law. But they are reluctant to do so. And right now they're trapped. They're stuck. They're hung up on something. Could be fear. It could be. Somebody is hung up. 
there'll be a loss of a relationship, right? They're, they're, they're hung up on the relationship. They're hung up on, you know, what everybody else is going to say. King of Pentacles could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, could be dealing with a Pisces, could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or a Libra, Gemini, or Aquar Aquarius. This person is very solid, very grounded, very stable. Um, this guy is a planner. He has the money and the skills to be successful. And he's thinking about whether he should... Uh, invest in something by the looks of things he's looking up at it's almost like he's thinking this person it doesn't have this can be a male or a female that's the way i feel with this card i feel like that, that we have somebody here that is thinking about their child or their children what they should do or about a child or about a situation that is it's definitely emotional and it's like there's a definitely a lack of confidence. There's there's fear and there's lack of recognition. It's like maybe even a lack of respect. Somebody may be in a situation where, you know, there's really no growth there. There's no happiness. There's nothing to celebrate. But Ten of Swords, there's a lot of suffering. This is suffering. This is painful. This is absolutely painful. It really is. We have somebody here that is suffering. All they have to do is get up and face their fears. They need to get up. They need to find the strength. Somebody needs to find the strength to do what they have to do to bring success. Somebody is hung up on fear. And it's like there's an opportunity to take back control of a situation, but there's reluctance to fight. It's like I'll have to fight for what I believe in. You know, you have, and it's like I don't know if I can deal with it. I don't know if I'm strong enough. Well, you are strong enough. You know, it's not over. It's not over yet. You have the strength. You know, you can't just sit there and let whatever this situation is consume you. You know, I think we have somebody here that is, is, Really thinking about um, putting up a fight, putting in effort to regain control over a situation, uh, to take back, to break free from something perhaps. Somebody is chained to something that is unhealthy. They've been hanging on to it because of what everybody else is going to say. You know, what is what is this going to do to the family? What is this going to do to... Uh, what is it? What are my friends going to say? What is everybody going to say? And what, you know, everybody's going to be watching. Everybody's going to see this, you know, so that it's definitely going to make an impact if I, you know, do what I have to do. So I feel like we have somebody here that has been letting, been keeping their mouth shut. They've just been laying down on the ground, laying low, you know, not making any moves. But I feel like this person is really thinking about their next step. What am I going to do here? What am I going to do? It's like... Two of Pentacles will cause so much chaos, upheaval. Somebody is thinking about the upheaval. Um, somebody may have regrets for the poor, the decisions that they have made already. Definitely feeling guilty and regretful for, you know, the 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 upheaval that has already been caused. Somebody is definitely struggling with making a choice, making a decision whether they want to. Uh, speak up or not. It's like this person is having a hard time communicating and it's eating them alive, laying down and letting themselves be walked on by another person, letting themselves be controlled by this unhealthy situation. I think there is a child or children involved here. Um, and this will probably cause upheaval in the family. So somebody is, is allowing themselves to be changed to this situation that isn't healthy. Um, this could cause major family drama. So I feel like we have somebody here that is really thinking long and hard. Knight of Cups reversed about... Um, Something that has been really emotionally unfulfilling. We have somebody here that hasn't been following their heart. And it's like there's a relationship that is probably going to um, suffer. There is a relationship that is, is going to suffer um, if whoever is so worried takes action. Um, 
I think we have somebody here that wants to um, break free from something. Or they want to break somebody free. You know what I mean? It could be go either way. But they're very reluctant to do so. They're very reluctant to do so. This person is very... Uh, they're definitely struggling, having a hard time sleeping, very worried and stressed. Because they know that they have to make a decision, but it's a hard one. It, it, they know. <laughs> I knew they did know. I, I And I was going to clarify this decision. They do know. It's like their gut is telling them. They know. They know they have to. They know they have to, but <sighs> it's a tough decision. It is definitely a tough decision. Um, there is a disconnection here. There's, there's a disconnection. There's lack of communication. There's uh, probably going to be an argument. Or something like that. Somebody has been allowing. They've. It's like they've given their power away to a toxic individual, and it's like they know. It's like their gut is plaguing them. It's like their gut is saying, "You must take action. This is not compatible. This is not right. This is not meant to be." It's like you know it's not meant to be. Somebody's been stalling. They have been. Um, but we do have somebody here again that knows. That knows we have this Queen of Swords. She's a quick thinker. She comes up with new ideas. She takes a new approach and she beats, she asserts herself. Somebody may be involving the law because the Queen or King of Swords can be the law. You know, it's, it's you know, getting the law involved with a situation. This is somebody who, um, discovers something she she is an investigator she may have discovered that you know she has to tell the truth she has to speak up somebody is going to speak up somebody is about to speak up about a partnership that isn't right it's not meant to be it's just not meant to be it's not oh it's going to be in a very intense time an intense and emotional. I think it is a very intense and emotional time. Um, somebody is is going to take a new opportunity. They are they're going to go. They're going to follow their heart. Somebody's about to follow their heart. They're going to let go of their regret, regrets. They're going to stop stalling. They got this new energy and they're ready to move forward. I think we have somebody here that is is about to do the right thing, and it. They're going to face their fears. And I, I think this has to do with the child. So if they see this opportunity and they have to take it. They, this is an opportunity to uh, remove something or to remove themselves from a toxic, unhealthy situation. And that is exactly what we have here. This is going to cause, uh, could cause breaks in relationships, could cause relationship problems with the family, the friends, a complete uproar with the two of pentacles reversed. Maybe, uh, um, <clears throat> somebody is about to, uh, it's like come to the rescue. This is, this is like, this is, this is, this is coming to the rescue. Or move on, move away, move some. It's because it, usually in the Six of Swords, it's like somebody driving somebody away. Usually that's what it is. So this is like bring somebody to a better place. This Queen of Swords, she is quite factual. She is about to speak the truth about a relationship that is not compatible, it's not good, it's not healthy, it's not healthy. Somebody's about to hear the truth, the truth is about to be spoken. Somebody is ready to just move forward, it's like they got this new idea, and they're, it's like they're going for it, they're going for it, and I feel like they're going to involve somebody, they're going to involve somebody to help them.
We have a new opportunity here. This is seizing a new opportunity. We could have a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius that is... I mean, this is a new opportunity for love. It's like I see the opportunity, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, to move to a better place. So I'm not sure how that resonates with you, but it feels like we have we have somebody here that is... This is freedom from an incompatible situation where it's not compatible, it's not working out, it is not meant to be, it's, it's not. And moving away from that, we have somebody here that has made a decision based on facts that it is time to go. It is time to go. The decision has been made. Seven of Cups. It's like their gut has told them that they have to do something. And they're going to do it. They are going to do it. And I think they are going to, they might even, somebody might even involved the law. Somebody is, is about to present the facts. This is very factual. This is a very factual. The fact is. The fact is, this isn't this relationship isn't meant to be. The fact is, this isn't stable. It's not secure. It's not a happy home. That's a fact. So I feel like today is a day where we have somebody here that is... Um, Seeing a situation absolutely clearly. There's a lot of clarity here. Clearly, 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 okay? That it's time to go. It's time to go. It's time to uh, speak up. Somebody's about to speak their truth. The truth is about to be spoken. And it has to do with this. Somebody's about to take a new approach. It's taking a new approach and taking a new approach. Somebody's about to take a new approach and... uh start over start fresh start from the beginning start with a clean slate we have a new beginning here we have somebody here that is about to embark on a new journey they're ready to fight somebody is ready to fight Eight of Cups, this is walking away. Somebody is going to walk away from somebody. They're going to walk away from somebody. They're going to walk away from something that is emotionally unfulfilling. It feels like they're being rescued. The King of Pentacles is a planner, making the plan. So I feel like we have somebody here that is making a plan to fight for and defend some defend themselves. This is very defensive as well. Somebody is saying goodbye to an emotionally unfulfilling situation in the very near future. So I feel like today we have somebody here that ha is, it's like this person is seeing a situation clearly. Their gut has told them that there is a relationship that has fallen apart. Relationship that has fallen apart. Not only their gut, it's like they know. They know, they've seen it with their own eyes. It's totally clear, 100% clear that this can't go on. This cannot go on. Somebody is about to take back control from another person. Take back their power. 
It's almost like take the control right away. This may have to do with a child. It may have to do with an unrequited love situation that somebody has been staying in. Somebody is saying goodbye. And they're headed down a new path with the, with the Fool card. They're headed down a new path. They have made the decision. And the decision has been made. And the decision has absolutely been made. It's time to go. Somebody is absolutely leaving. And there's going to be ties that are severed because of this situation. This is severing ties. It's been a very big struggle. Now we have these three fives. Okay, five, five, five is uh, expect the unexpected. Where are the three fives? I saw them. I saw them. <laughs> it's been a very discombobulating day. It really has. There's one five. Anyway, five, five, five. Expect the unexpected. I don't need them anyway. I saw them in my head. <laughs> I did too. Anyway, expect the unexpected. Expect the unexpected. Somebody is about to hear the truth. I'm not even looking at the cards now. Somebody is about to hear the truth. Somebody is about to take back control. They're about to rip control right out of somebody's hands. And it's going to cause family chaos. It's going to cause an uproar. Good luck. 